Okay, guys. I hate to admit it, but I was wrong. That's right. I was wrong. Psych. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to the channel once again. I am Robert Storm. As always, if you're finding me for the very first time, please be sure to click that like and subscribe button. That way you guys stay up to date on all future content here on my channel. If you guys like the content and want more exclusive content, then join the membership. There's three tiers to choose from. So, guys. Uh, about a year ago, maybe a little longer, not quite sure, time does kind of fade away, I made the statement that the Snyder Cut does not exist, that the Zack Snyder Cut of Just League does not exist, and everybody and their mom was just throwing shade at me during my trailer reaction going, oh my god, he said it doesn't exist, oh, how you feel now, Rob, how are you gonna act like you're excited when you said the shit didn't exist, calm down, please. Take a step out of your mom's basement. See the world. Collect yourself. Bond with Mother Nature and get a life, okay? So I kind of want to address this because this was coming up a lot. Basically, what I said, if you go back and watch those videos, because every video that I always do, if I'm not sure on a topic, I always put a question mark at the end of the topic. You know why? Because it's a topic for discussion. I'm not stating facts. So if you see a question mark, then it's a topic for discussion. We're discussing it. So let's discuss this. So back when I said that, the Snyder Cut did not exist, I break the question, well, does it exist? Does it really exist? And the thing is, it did not exist. Yes, a cut of the film existed, but there was no CGI, there was green screen all through the movie, the special effects weren't done, the audio wasn't done, the music score wasn't done. So by definition, the movie didn't exist. It didn't exist. It was a pre pre cut. It was like a trademark. You know when you ever watch those movies when you go to test shootings or stuff and they're like special effects goes here and you see a sign that says special. That's the way the Snyder Cut was. It was not ready for people to see the movie. If the Snyder Cut existed, people, then why the hell did WB have to give Zack Snyder millions of dollars to finish it? Keyword: finish. So the Snyder Cut did not exist. Did he shoot footage for it? Yes. Was it put together very roughly? Maybe. Probably. But as a film, it did not exist. So I was right. From a certain point of view. Yes, I went straight Obi-Wan Kenobi on your asses. Yes, I was right from a certain point of view. The movie did not exist. It was not a movie. It was footage put together in a cut. That's the way most post-production movies are made, guys. You film footage, you put it together very roughly in a cut, then you go in and go, okay, I like this cut, let's go ahead and add the visuals, add the special effects, the CGI, the score, the music, the sound effects, and the dialogue. That's usually how it goes, guys. That's usually how it goes. But I love, I love how so many people don't know how the movie making process works. Likes to throw comments in the comment box going, you said it didn't exist. Well, do your research because it actually did not exist. There was a cut of it, but it wasn't finished. So in turn, it didn't exist. Sorry, didn't mean to school you. I would drop my mic, but it's on an arm, so can't help you. What are you going to do about it? Anyway, guys, I uh, just kind of wanted to clear the air on that. Um, I am happy we are against the Snyder Cut. I'm happy we're getting Zack Snyder's Justice League. It looks like a much better film. I'm excited for it. I liked Man of Steel. I liked BVS, the ultimate cut. The ultimate cut. And I am really looking forward to seeing the four-hour movie fest that is Zack Snyder's Justice League. So, guys, anyway, be sure to leave your comments in the comment box below. I'm pretty sure this is going to be a hot topic. But, um, yeah, just try to stay clean in there. Stop, try to stay clean in there, guys. Until next time, as always, I'm Robert Storms. That's my opinion. Later, guys.